Hey you guys, it's MJ and I'm back. Of course I'm back. I'm not going anywhere. Peace. Peekaboo. I see you. <laughs> Love that intro. Alright, so how are we? How are we today? I hope everyone is doing good. Um, I have my coffee. See? Matchy matchy. Oh. <laughs> Flop. Matchy matchy, right? Love it. Well, I hope you are doing fine. And I'm looking in here because there's a window over there. I thought somebody's passing by or oh my god. Is it or is it in the front? I'm so confused. Anyway. Um yeah, it's from a drama channel that I always watch and i like that video because it actually makes my day brighter it's funny well some of the topics that he discussed in there are just like um sobriety friendship and all of that dramas in the world anyway so today i wanted to do a video um just to talk about my friends because i miss them like do you ever miss your friends because like you know covid can't travel anyway i have two um good judies my very very good judies um erica mrs oh i keep on forgetting she's already mrs mrs erica matthias or matthias did i pronounce that right let me know girl and to um our bestie as well our good judy in the philippines nikki so erica is living in the US now and um Nikki is in still in the Philippines and of course I'm here in Australia like yeah <laughs> worlds apart right but hopefully we'll get together soon once we can travel again hopefully anyway I think we need some no not a lip gloss because my lips are hydrated, but we need a hand cream. When your hands are dry as mine, and it's hand cream beauty time, right? <gasps> Don't worry about it. Okay, so, oh, that smells so good. That is from the uh, grown, grown alchemist. Is it? Did I? Oh, I threw it up <laughs> far away. I can't reach it. Anyway, so yeah, just to um, tell you about this um, story. I remember, like when we were back in those days when we were working together. We were working in a call center, and the three of us. Um, we actually didn't get along at first because I was like the, you know, the talkative one. I'm I'm the loud one. And I'm always like, hi, hello, how are you? And then Nick, she's like, well, we call her Nicky. That's not her true name. I'm not sure if <laughs> she wants me to expose her true name. Let me know, girl um yeah nikki is like not the quiet one but she's the slow talker one you know and how you have one of those girlfriends that just talk slow yes like this but you have to listen because she's so so funny and erica is like the sassy one so she's like ah, no yes the classy sassy one so i First, they actually didn't like me because I was like loud. I'm the loud one. I'm like, yeah, you want to go here, want to go there, here, everywhere. And then they found out that I was actually nice, right? I know. Funny. So I just thought, oh, my dog. Oh, my dog is barking. Oh, no. Why is she barking? Somebody's there. Anyway back to my story so when we were all um starting so we were put in one team and 
as time goes by they realize that i'm actually a nice person and we became good judies we share lunch we go we always have this unplanned plans that means that we go somewhere like at the end of the shift um one of us will just say hey let's go here it's like two hours drive we would start at like seven in the evening because like we are on a graveyard shift so we would start at about 7 p.m and we finish at about four or five in the morning and yeah we would go to Tagaytay. that's one of the nice um colder areas and then we would just have um breakfast or what we call dinner at that time because it's like dinner for us at five o'clock in the morning and yeah we wanted a really like we really really bonded and it's just amazing on how when we talk to each other like we we just had like group chat a few days ago and it seems like it was just yesterday which is amazing it never felt like oh we haven't seen each other for like literally like five years or more than that um it's truly amazing how true good judies we are i can say and i'm gonna throw up some random pictures over the years that we had um yeah and it's i i miss them a lot and we always have um coffees and talking about gossips not really just talking about our lives and our customers really because since we work in a call center one day Nike, should I expose you on what you have done and what I did? I'm not sure about I'm not sure about Erica because Erica's like the good girl. Yeah, she is, truly. So one day, um because we were working in a call center, it's like ling a ling, shama ling ding ding dong ding. And then Nikki answered the phone and she's like, "Yes, hello. How can I help you?" And the uh, and the customer on the other line was so 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 angry because she just wanted to check the balance on her credit card. She doesn't want to talk to anyone, and she was so frustrated. And you know what she said? She's like, "I don't want to talk to you. I just want to talk to the animated system." Hear what I said? I just want to talk to the animated system. Oh, Barney. I just want to talk to the animated system. I don't want to talk to you. You know what she said? Yes, this is Donald Duck speaking. <laughs> How can I help you? I'm not sure if that got monitored, but <laughs> that was pretty funny. And the customer on the other line just started laughing her ASS off. It was so funny. And she's like, okay, can you just please give me my balance, whatever, whatever. And of course, me hearing that thing, tried it. Like, hello, this is Daisy Duck speaking. How can I help you? Because we always get that. I just want to talk to the animated system. I don't want to talk to a real person. Okay, well, yes, this is Minnie Mouse speaking. How can I help you? And they would start laughing and bursting into tears of the other line laughing so that was pretty good oh another one oh this is actually really really bad because my team leader actually monitored this particular call it was so bad so i was like an account manager in the retention where you know you want to close your account and i'm on the other line trying to convince you about the benefits and things like that so i was like and i was half asleep like literally maybe almost there like dreaming so i was like yes hello i wanted to close uh you wanted to close your account okay i'm gonna close your account blah 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 and then i just realized that i actually haven't even asked her about her concern ask her what she wanted to do with the account or if she truly wants to close the account or not and i was like let me go ahead and close your account and 
<laughs> my team leader at that time. Shout out, hi Ryan, <laughs> if you're watching. That was so embarrassing. And he was like, you're closing the account, you haven't even talked to her. I'm like, I was asleep. Isn't it obvious? Guys, it's hard when it's like three in the morning and you're tired and you're just like, yes, yes, yes. But anyway, did I get a written warning on that? No, I think I just got a verbal warning to be awake when I'm on my shift. So after that incident, my... Um, my team leader is always asking me, have you had your coffee? Are you awake? I'm like, yes. I'm awake. So funny. Uh, if you will see that car driving because we ordered a plant box. Because I am into plants right now. So yeah, we just had um, a plant box ordered and it's being delivered now. So yeah. Anyway, so yeah, I just miss my friends and um, Yeah, basically that's, that's just I wanted that's the only thing I actually wanted to say And discuss over here When your lips as dry as Peter <laughs> I Don't have the lunar beauty, but I have a mecha maxima Yes, hydration. Should I throw it? Ah, it didn't break. Amazing. And well, I hope you guys are doing fine if you haven't talked to your friends or if you're feeling lonely these days because of, you know, you, we can't travel so much. But I'm glad like things are opening up. Vaccines are available. So if you haven't got it, get it if you can i haven't got mine just because we have um a certain rules in australia like the first one that would have to get it are the frontliners then the elderly then certain age group so i not in that age group that needs to get it as of yet so i'm thinking that probably i would be getting it around the end of the year or early next year so once my age group is up i'm definitely getting it well thank you so much guys for sticking up and watching this video and i'll see you on the next one have a nice day bye